have no way of knowing whether or not you've ever sold men's and women's apparel before, but for the purpose of acquainting you with the way Sears likes to go about this very big and important part of its business, it's best for both of us that I assume you have not. The Sears divisions in men's and women's apparel, which we'll talk about, include clothing worn by men and women, boys and girls, from shoes and smocks to suits and sportswear, blouses and brassieres to swimming suits and sweaters, mittens and maternity clothes, overcoats and raincoats. If it's to wear, Sears has it. And since Sears is the biggest store in the world, it carries the very best of everything. Sears' unconditional money-back guarantee stands behind every sale. Since the caveman first draped himself in animal skins and quit running around the countryside naked, clothing has become a major factor in the world. And in all the world, our customers are the champions when it comes to buying clothes. Today's family has more money to spend on clothing than ever before, and today's family is sophisticated about what its members wear. Newspapers, magazines, and television carry the latest fashion trends into the home, and our customers are vitally interested in fashion. Now, fashion means fit, style, color, and fabric. And today's family buys far more clothes than in the old days. Just compare the closets built into the modern home with those built 20 years ago. But selling men's and women's apparel takes a special kind of salesperson, the person with the personal touch, the person of good taste, the person who knows fashion, fit, and fabric, and complementary colors. So the best advice I can give you is that the moment you're assigned to a division, whether it's men's work and sport clothing and outerwear, women's skirts, blouses, sweaters, and sportswear, or shoes, whatever it happens to be, learn everything you can learn about what you're selling. You must become an expert on the items sold in your division. Know your merchandise and where to find out about it. In the catalog pages, merchandise lists, and from the information printed on the hang tags and on the packaging. Be sure to study your basic training handbooks, too. When a Sears customer wants advice, you'll be able to give it. You'll be an expert worth turning to. If you don't know the answer, say, excuse me, I'll find out for you, and then ask someone who knows. But make sure you get the answer. How you dress is more important when you're selling men's and women's apparel than anywhere else. You're selling fashion, so make certain you look the part. You're a walking Sears advertisement, and the people who come into your division should want to dress as you do, not wildly and flamboyantly, but quietly and in excellent taste. Remember that Sears isn't just interested in selling one item of clothing. Sears wants to keep the customer for many years to come, and the customer's friends and family. So make certain the customer is completely satisfied. Really good salespeople are those who think only of the customer and his well-being. Also, this is the most intimate kind of selling. You'll be touching people, so make certain you're as clean when you come to work as you can be, that your hands and nails are impeccable. If you offend a customer in any way by body odor, bad breath, or any indication of uncleanliness, you and Sears have lost a customer and the customer's family. Treat young people, children, and teenagers with the same courtesy and good cheer that you use for adults. Try to be the sort of person that will make the customer want to ask for you the next time he or she comes in. Keep your division clean. Put things neatly back where you found them, or where they belong, whether you originally took them out or not. Go out of your way to make your division the neatest and best looking. Keep it well stocked. Your division manager will tell you about other duties as time goes on. You know, our days are divided into two main periods. There's the time when we're off work, which is most of the time, and there's the time when we're on the job. During the time you're working at Sears, keep busy. You'll enjoy your days far more and enjoy your leisure just that much more. When a customer comes into your division, approach him or her promptly with a smile. Never say, may I help you. The customer will almost always respond with a, no thank you, I'm just looking answer. If the customer is looking at something, make a comment about it, such as, that's a beautiful garment, isn't it? And did you notice the new neckline? Get the customer into the picture immediately. Treat the customer as a friend. Put him at ease and win his confidence with your knowledge of your merchandise. Never high pressure a Sears customer. Make certain he or she is completely satisfied. Tell about the merchandise, its advantages, its quality points. The clothing business is built on personal trade. And use suggestion selling and show the merchandise. If the customer buys a blouse, suggest a sweater or skirt. If a man or boy buys a suit, you'd recommend a raincoat or other item. Every item purchased lends itself to suggestion selling. Always show the best merchandise first, not just because it costs more, but because the customer may prefer it. It'll give better service and therefore cost less in the long run. Always start at the top of the line, and if the customer is looking at something down the line, suggest something from the top. 
Now let me briefly summarize these points. You might want to make notes and refer to them from time to time. One, learn all you can about fashion, which means fit, style, color, and fabric. Two, dress in quiet, good taste. Three, make certain that the customer is completely satisfied. Four, arrive at work clean, and be sure you don't offend. Five, treat all customers with the same unfailing courtesy. Six, keep your division clean, and always put things back where they belong. Seven, while you're on the job, keep busy. Eight, when a customer comes into your division, approach the customer promptly with a smile. Never say, may I help you? And nine, always show the best merchandise first. Start at the top and use suggestion seller. Listen to this message as often as you need to to fully understand it. You can be proud of what you're selling and especially proud of where you're selling. Sears, good luck to you.